Hi, we're coming to you live from Foxborough High School where it is senior night where the Foxborough Varsity Volleyball Team is playing the Westwood Varsity Volleyball Team. I'm Caitlin Deneen. And I'm Sarah Brennan. <laughs> and we are so excited to <laughs> announce <laughs> thank you. It's gonna be a good one. <laughs> We were just really excited to watch the varsity play. <laughs> Sorry, the volleyball players are just being quite rowdy right now. We're getting <laughs> We were very sorry. This is our first time doing this. And it's a very funny experience. I think this is gonna be a good game tonight. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> So it looks like right now they're lining up to welcome our seniors, Sadie Calabrese and Gabby Collarin. Yep, we're so excited for them. They've been playing since their freshman years of high school and they have made it to the varsity level. So they're gonna be welcomed in by the all the Foxborough, JV, and varsity players. like they have flowers prepared for both the Canton High the Westwood High School seniors and the Foxborough High School seniors. And tonight's scoring we have the lovely teacher Mr. Kayser and there's a picture of Sadie Calabrese and Gabby Collarin, the two Foxborough seniors, very nice girls, love them both. Mm -hmm. As you can see, some of the Foxborough girls are wearing their oh, I Love My Senior shirts for the senior night tonight. We also wore those at school today. All right. Looks like they're about to start. Our family, friends, our Foxborough cable viewers, and Westwood fans to Foxborough High School Senior Night. Mira Gideon.
to start up. Looks like Westwood's on the court and Foxborough's about to go. I wonder what's going through Coach Vicky's head right now. Foxborough's had a tough season, but hopefully they can pull through for their senior night. Yeah. <laughs> Westwood looks pretty pumped up, but I think Foxborough will be able to pull through with a win tonight. Mm-hmm. The Westwood JV team was pretty good, so we'll see how the Westwood plays. plays. Yep. There goes Sadie, one of the seniors. Number 15, Alyssa Clority. Number 16, Mallory Meyer. Number 18, Gabby Collin, are also, also our other senior. Number five, Cindy Lebo. And number two, Juliana Pettigrew. Yep. All right. We're just doing a lineup check and then we'll get started. So we, that means the ref is just checking to see everyone's in the right spot at the right time. I'm not sure who has the serve first. It looks oh, it like looks like it's Fox Foxborough. All right, and Alyssa Clority will have the first serve. I know she has a pretty She's strong She's a great serve. serve. All right, let's see how Alyssa Clority does. And Franklin is not, and Westwood is not able to get that ball over. And Boxborough wins the first point. Pretty nice serve by Alyssa Clority. I feel like her serve makes it hard for the other team to return the ball. It's a pretty hard serve. And get a nice bump set hit. And, a and that's an ace. Nice job, Alyssa. Yep, Alyssa has a pretty tough serve to beat. I think that's why Coach Vicky put her in first. Let's see if Westwood can receive this one. All right, nice receive by number 17. And, and a hit, but it was out. A beautiful hit, but too far by number 15 on Westwood. All right, let's see if Alyssa can do it for the fourth point. Ooh, Ooh that, was that was a nice hard serve. one. But that was tip. a tip by number 15. 
And a nice hit by Sadie Calabrese, our senior captain. Another tip. Lissa was able to return it. Another hit by Sadie. Oh, Very that nice was a nice by kill. Sadie. Number 17 just isn't able to return it. And Alyssa Florida gets her fourth point in a row serving. So far, Fox Rod has a strong lead. Yep. Oh. All Ooh, right, nice receive by the Libero, number one. Oh, but they, they couldn't get it over. Yep. All right, let's see if Alyssa Florida can get her sixth serve over in a row. I have faith in her. And it is in. Nice receive, but they, they got it over. Got that was over. a great play. Yep. It's by Westwood. All right, let's see if number 15. Ooh. Number 15 makes some great hits. The past two have been out, but number 15, I think, is probably one of their strongest <coughs> hitters. Let's see if number eight on Westwood has a strong serve, just like Alyssa. We're watching them in one and it looked like they had pretty good serves. Yep, I agree. Let's hope Fox Road can return this one. And that was a pretty strong serve, but Mallory is able to make it over, and Sydney's able to set it over. Free ball by number 17. Set by Sydney. Sydney just has a beautiful set. And Mallory, that was a Great Ooh. hit. Great save by Sydney again. And a great Very block nice by Sadie. And Foxborough wins the point. A lot of fans that showed up in the stands tonight, it looks like. Yep. All right. Let's look at that replay. It's looks nice like three mm. by Mallory. Yep. And Franklin's it. Westwood's able to get it up. And it goes right into the deep. All right, Ellis Pooley. Tip by Sydney. Hit by number nine. Very oh. nice hit. They were able to get it over, so Foxborough could not return it. Here's number nine up to serve for oh. Westwood. She's tall, so tall people use, tend to have nice serves. Let's see if she does. Ooh, and it looks like it's a jump serve. Very nice serve. Nice receive by Shannon. Our libero on varsity. Nice hit by Juliana Pettigrew. Nice hit by number 17. And the ball just goes right in. It was almost on the line. And number nine is serving again. Let's see if she can keep this streak up. Let's hope Fox Rowe can return this ball. Another great serve. And Shannon gets it again. And that same play, I believe, happened last time. And Taylor got a great hit. Ooh. Oh. And it hits the ceiling and is Westwood's <laughs> point. All right, here we're replaying the last hit, which is a beautiful hit by Juliana Pettigrew, but also a beautiful save by number eight. And then just an amazing hit by 17 that Foxborough could not receive. Now Foxborough is able to get it up after Westwood tipped it. Once again, another strong hit to the back corner, which Foxborough can't seem to receive. It seems like Westwood has some really great hitters, <coughs> and sometimes it's hard for Foxborough to receive those balls. Hopefully they can pick up the pace and start receiving. A yeah, better. it's a really hard spot when they put it really deep in the corner like that. Yep. And now Westwood, number nine, is serving once again. And that was a pretty hard serve, but they're able to get it up. And a set by Shannon. But it was two, two touches, touches, so that means her hand touched the ball twice and was not a true set. And number nine will be setting again. It's now tied up, six to six. Hopefully Foxborough can get those points back. And that was a nice up by Mallory. And a nice, nice hit right by side Sydney. Hit. Right She's side is a very hard position to play, but Sydney is very good at it. Yep. Sydney is also a great setter, but she prefers to play right. Now up to serve is number 16, Mallory. Mallory has an amazing serve and is a great player. Let's hope she can 
get it in. Nope, it's just a little too far out, and Westwood wins that point. Now up to serve number 15 for Westwood. Let's see if Foxborough can receive this one. And another jump serve, but goes far out. Ooh. I'm sorry, I thought that ball was out, but it looked like it was in, and number 15 will be serving again. Sometimes it's hard for the refs to see when that podium, but yep. Number 15 is now serving again. Let's see if she can do it again. And that serve is in. Got up and nice hit, hit by, Juliana. by Juliana. All right, hits the ceiling. Goes right over by Westwood. Oh, that was a good hit by number 19 in the front. Yep, last time the ball hit the ceiling, Foxborough was not able to get it up, but Westwood was. That's something that Foxborough may need to work on. Westwood now has the lead, so hopefully Foxborough can catch up. Yep, I agree. Another amazing up by Sydney LeBeau. A great hit by Mallory. Set and it goes just out of the box. And Boxrow wins that point and is now. All right. I'm just replaying that play right here. You can see Juliana Pettigrew has an amazing hit, but they're also able to get it up. Hits the ceiling. And able to get it back over. It over. And Foxrow is able to get that ball, but it gets hit over. Right. Now an outside hit by 17, and that's a kill. Shannon was not able to receive that. That's all right. She was she was able to touch the ball, but couldn't get right under there. Also now in the middle is number, I can't see your number, but it's Ava Kirk. Ooh, and, and that's serve. by number 17, a nice short serve. Foxborough wasn't able to return. All right, instant replay. Alyssa Clority just isn't able to get that up. All right, number 17 serving again for Westwood. Nice Shannon up was by able to Shannon. Get up. And a nice hit by Ava, Ava Kirk. Kirk. Oh. And Westwood is able to win the point by a tip on that one that Foxborough wasn't able to die for. And number 17 is serving it again. Score is now eight to 12, and Westwood is up by four. Shannon gets that up nicely, and tip. Oh, good try by Ava Kirk. Nice block by Westwood. Number 17 is serving yet again. She has a pretty consistent serve. It's typically short. And now in number 10, Gianna Dunn, who is actually a sophomore in the back row. Hit by Mallory, it just goes a little too short. Not able to get over the net. Oh, that was a nice tip by Ava Westwood. So Foxborough has taken a timeout. I think they're just a little nervous over the few serves they've lost. Hopefully they're able to get it back. Sometimes, and this happens to us too, when they start losing a few points. They get it in their, <laughs> they get it in their heads, and they just stop stop communicating, and they get nervous, and then they lose more points. So they just gotta shake off the last few bad plays and pull ahead. Yep, the score is eight to fourteen. Westwood is winning. Twenty seconds left on the clock. You can see Vicky is coaching them with her hands, and the assistant coach is also helping them out. Hopefully Foxborough is able to get this one back. All right, number 17 has a serve for Westwood once again. See if she can get this one. And ace. All right, Shannon's able to get that up. Bump set by Alyssa. And a hit that goes just out by Julianne Pettigrew. Number 17 is serving again. This is, she's had quite a few serves in a row. 
And we'll see what she can do. Another good serve by 17. And a middle hit. Hit goes out by Ava Kirk. 17 has a serve yet again. Gotta snap that wrist. I agree. Nice serve by 17. Mallory's able to get it out. Alyssa sets and Ooh, Westwood is able to get it over for a free ball, which means a ball bumping over. Oh, and, and yet Westwood another block. the net, but uh, the ref did not see that and called it Westwood's point. All right, 17 with another serve. Amazing serve. Middle hit. Nice job. Nice job. Foxrow gets the point. Let's hope Foxrow can get these eight points back. <clears throat> All right. As you can see, Foxrow tips it over, and Westwood gets it over with a free, and Foxrow is able to easily set it up. Gianna Dunn, Alyssa Clorty sets it over, and it gets blocked. Now serving Juliana is a great serve. She also has a very strong serve on Foxborough. Outside hit, Juliana receives it. Gianna bumps it to outside Sadie Clarice, but it falls right out. Unfortunately, Foxborough loses yet another point. Number one, the libero for Westwood is now serving. Liberos is. tend to have a, t a nice yep. serve, so we'll see what she can do. Hits the net. It is a jump serve, so hopefully next time she'll be able to get that serve over. And we'll see. Now serving is senior Gabby Collarin. Gabby has a great strong serve. Yep. Let's hope she can ace this. Keep it in. Sometimes it has too much power and goes out. Great serve by Gabby. And it's and an, an ace. ace. Nice job, Gabby. Perfect serve for Gabby on her senior night. Yep. All right, let's see if Gabby Collarin can do it again. Number 17, who was also a great server, was not able to receive that. Let's see. Nice serve, they're able to up that nicely. And Outside number eight hit. goes in for a hit. A nice receive by Gabby, Shannon right. helps it out. Mallory puts it over. Number 10, 12, and 9. Nice an job by hit, Gianna. Right side hit. Oh, they got it the second time. Yep, unfortunately, Westwood was able to get that point, but we're going to do a replay. Amazing serve by Cabby Colloran. Number 10 is able to shanks it, and... Now number 12 is serving. Short oh. serve, Gianna yeah. Dunn is able to get it up. Let's see if the Calabrese tips that. Oh, what happened here? Sadie oh. Calabrese hit the net, the net and Westwood gets the point. It is now 20 to 11, Westwood. Let's hope Fox Row is able to catch up by the end of this game. Number 12 is serving again, and we'll see what she can do. Last time she had a short serve, let's see where it goes this time. Pretty short again. Up by Shannon, and another hit by Sadie. The barrel gets it up. Right side hit, into and the into net. Into the net, Foxborough gets the point. Very nice hit, approach, but she was not able to get it over. Slow climb for Foxborough, trying to catch up, but Alyssa Clority is up to serve again. She got four points in a row last time, so let's see if she can do it again. That's oh, an out serve by Alyssa Clorty. That's all right. Number 19 and number 8 is serving. And she had a nice serve last time. Let's see if she's able to get it over. Very powerful serve up by Mallory and hit by Sadie Calabrese. The Barrow's able to get it up. Another and outside up. hit. And into hit the, into net. the net. I believe that's... Westwood's second hit into the net. Hopefully they can improve their hits, but they do have quite a lead right now on Foxborough, so let's hope Foxborough can get it back. All right, Sadie Calabrese Sr. is serving. You can hear all the cheering from the crowd. Beautiful serve by Sadie. 
Westwood's able to up that pretty easily. And 17 does a tip. I and think, that yes. Goes out. And Foxborough gets the point. 14 to 21. Let's see if Foxborough can tie this up. Another serve by Sadie Calabrese, our senior. Hopefully she can do it again. Another good serve. Libera receives it. And it looks like it's going to be a free. Oh. Alyssa Clority one hands that, and it's not the nicest. Not a smart decision. Yep. Number nine is now serving again. She does have quite a powerful serve. Let's see if she can do it again. Another good serve that falls nice short. jump serve. Hit by Juliana. Juliana tends to have really nice hits. Hit by 17. Nice, nice up, up. Uh, Gabby. Yep. Ooh, oh. and a hit that goes out by Cindy LeBeau. She plays right side. She typically does nice hits. That one just went a little too far out. Again, they got to snap the wrist. And another timeout by Vicky. Smart de decision trying to ice out the Westwood server. It is now 23 to 14. Foxborough's down by nine. Yep. Math. With 44 seconds remaining on the timer. Hear the crowd cheering, and I wonder what Vicky's seen to them. All right, here's a replay for you guys. Up by Alyssa Clority, hit by Juliana Pettigrew. The uh, Westwood's able to receive that nicely, and 17 gets a beautiful hit that Gabby Collarin's able to up. Sadie Calabri, uh, Alyssa Clorney makes a nice set, but Sydney hits it just out, and Westwood gets the point. Still yep. serving, number nine for Westwood. Yep. All right, let's hope Foxborough can get this back. A nice jump serve by number nine. Mallory's able to get it up. And a failed tip attempt by number 15. Goes into the net. Let's see. Mallory is serving this time around. She did hit it out last time. Let's hopefully she can keep this ball in. Beautiful serve, and, and it's a an shame ace. by number eight. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Let's see if Mallory can do it again. Nice up by Libero, and 15 goes in for a hit. Tip. Mm, nice dig by Alyssa. Juliana gets it over. Middle. And out. Wow, nice Foxborough job, gets girls. the point. They're only down by six now. Let's see if they can keep it up. So serving number 16, Mallory for Foxborough. Another short serve, which is a good tactic because sometimes she can go 15, out. 15, nice block. Was able Free to get it over. By Middle again, push. Nice, nice hit. hit by Ava Kirk. She's able to put it in the exact right spot at the right time, and Westwood is not able to receive that ball. Let's hope Foxborough can keep this up. Mallory is still serving. Now they're only down by five. Nice serve by Mallory. Eight to able to get it up. Twelve is able to bump it. Push. Up. Alyssa. Oh. Yep, Alyssa's had it quite a few. Looks like the libero hits it, and they set middle. She's nice a great push. push. She's able to get it up, though. Clarity's able to set it very nicely. And hit by Ava. Now I just missed what well, happened. While playing that, uh, Mallory shanked the ball, and Foxborough lost the set, unfortunately. It looks like we're going into the next set. Fox Row only lost by seven, so hopefully they're able to get it back during the next set. I think they did pretty good. I also think they did pretty good compared to the season that they've been having. They just have some little things they need to work on, just smart decisions during play. Yep, I agree. And being able to return, I think the outside hits are the, I think the outside hits 
are very hard to, for them to receive, but they'll be able to work on that. Mm -hmm. And number 15 on Westwood also has a really strong hit. 15 and 17 both have quite strong hits, so Foxborough just needs to learn how to get under that. And despite losing the set, Foxborough girls look pretty happy. I think they played pretty well, so they should be proud of themselves. And hopefully they can pull through in this set. Yep. For those of you that don't know, a uh, varsity volleyball game is out of five sets, so they have to win at least three. And a set goes to 25, and Westwood won the first set. On the sidelines here, you can see Coach Vicky, her assistant, and Coach Haley Knowles, who is the coach of the freshman team at Foxborough. Coach Vicky just gave them the lineup. Let's see if she's gonna change it up a little bit or keep it the same. I think Gabby did pretty well, and so did Sadie. Yep, very nice for their senior night. Mm -hmm. And yeah, you can see Sadie Calabrese dancing. <laughs> She's quite excited. I think she's doing pretty well. For the starting a chance. <laughs> yep, as you can see, <laughs> everyone's the girls chanting. Are. The girls are excited. <laughs> Let's hope they can pull through. through Keep that stuff. excitement in the game. Yep. All right, Coach Vicky's discussing the lineup right now, it looks like. And there you can see the fans. Looks like there's quite a few fans in this section. Freshman Normally. and JV team. Yep, you can see the freshmen in the pink and the other people in the black. Here's some nice There's, balloons. Yep. And then a man. <laughs> <laughs> All right. There's the Westwood section. All right. Westwood's up on the court. Let's see if Foxborough comes out soon. And you can also now see, oh, never mind, but you could see Coach Dave, who is the JV volleyball coach. Yep. Very nice sitting man. Sitting on the sidelines. Amazing coach. Looks like Vicky is calling out the lineup right now. And doing the scoreboard and libero tracker, you can see Olivia and Melanie from the JV volleyball team. Mm -hmm. The ref is just waiting on Fox Row. There they go in for their handshake. And there goes the buzzer. I'm excited to see how the second set goes. So it looks like on the court again, we have setter 15, Alyssa Cloherty, number two, Juliana Pettigrew, 16, Mallory Meyer, three, Ava Kirk, five, Sydney Lebo, and 11, senior captain, Sadie Calabrese. Now, Shannon McCainley. Looks like Sadie's just putting up her hair really quickly to prepare for this game. She is quite long hair, as most of us mention mm -hmm. often. All right, the Foxborough girls are ready for this game. They're going to win. Yep, Ava Kirk had an amazing first set. Yep. There's a nice serve, and Foxborough is able to get it up, and beautiful mm, hit nice by hit. Sydney LeBeau. Nice hit. Oh. Mallory tries to get it up. Unfortunately, she puts it under the net, and no one on Fox Pro is able to help her out with that. Can't go under the net. Yep. All right. Serve by number eight on Westwood. Nice serve. And Mallory's able to get it up. Alyssa's able to put it, set it. And nice hit. Nice hit by, by Sydney. Sydney LeBeau. At outside. Chick, chick, boom. Now tied 1-1, one, one. let's see who's serving first. Gabby Collar and our senior, let's see if she can have some nice serves like she just had before. Let's go Gabby. Nice and it looks serve. like her serve's gone out. Oh, that's all right. And as you can see, Mallory Mayer gets it up, Alyssa bump sets it, Sydney LeBeau hits it, and Westwood is not able to return that. Beautiful. Nice play. job, Sydney. All right. Serve by. 22. Yep. And then. Oh. Franklin. Westwood is able to block that. Uh, they have quite a few tall players in the front. Foxborough is not that fortunate, so they do not. Their tall players seem to be more in the back. Mm-hmm. 
can hear the Westwood players cheering for their teammates. And number 22 is serving again. And serve is nice. Alyssa's able hit. to set it, and Sydney's able to hit it. Nice up by Shannon. Pushed by Sydney Liebel on the right side. Oh, Beautiful that hit. was a big by kill Westwood. by the middle. All right, Westwood number 22 is serving yet again. And the ball is a floater outside. Oh. Unfortunately, it hits the antenna by Juliana Pettigrew. Nice and try. Fox for somebody. Let's get that point. As you can see, Sydney pushes it over. Westwood gets it up. Nice set and hit by number eight. Number nine, I'm sorry. Mallory Kitts. Another try by Juliana. Goes over this time. Big hit by right side, number 15 on Westwood. Unfortunately, number six shanked it, but it's all right. Hopefully, Foxborough can get these five points back. It's easiest to come back in the first few points. Yep. All right, number 22, serving. Nice serve again. Nice up by Gabby Carin. Nice right side set by Alyssa. And Sydney's able to hit that. Box Another up. hit, Juliana. Westwood has some very good defense. Ooh, Shannon unfortunately shanked that into the ground. All right, up by Westwood, and beautiful hit. Looks like Coach Vicky has called an early timeout. Smart decision. Better get these points back now rather than wait till later. Yep. I think Vicky's probably talking to them about how they need to work on receiving those hits and making, maybe making those hits a little stronger. They've gotten quite a few tips over Westwood, so Foxborough needs to work on receiving those. And there's our game ball. Hey guys. There's <laughs> us. <laughs> and just. <laughs> Like Foxborough is still ready to get it back. Haven't gotten discouraged yet. Nope. All right, here comes 22 with a, another serve. All right, beautiful serve by 22. Nice up and Oh, big block for Westwood by number nine once yep, again. It was a nice attempted hit by Mallory Mayer. 22 still up to serve. Looks like they weren't able to ice her. Another good serve. Shannon nice Delibero. Nice. Oh, Sydney nice hits into the net. That's right. Sydney's gotten quite a few nice hits. Up by Alyssa Party and attempted hit by Mallory, but number nine blocks it. Nice up by Shannon, nice bump set, and hit by Juliana Pettigrew. Number 15 hits it, but it goes out, and Foxborough finally gets the point. Mm -hmm. Now it is nine to two. Now going in is Ava Kirk for Gabby Collarin. Ava's had some a few nice blocks and has some good hits in the first set. All right. Now serving is Mallory Mayer, number 16. Looks like they're a little confused about the lineup right now. I think Coach Vicky's calling a lineup check. If you are out of rotation, the other team will get a point, so you want to try not to do that. Looks like they're just a little confused. It shouldn't be too much of a problem. All right, 
codes for keys. Just making sure everything's set. Mallory Mayer is getting ready to serve. Foxborough is ready. All right, Gabby Karn is going in for Ava Kirk. All right, it looks like Ava tried going a little bit too early. Oh, Shannon the libero actually subbed out for Ava. All right, let's hope Mally can get this serve over and in and not too far out. Let's see what she can do. Looks like the refs are talking about something right now, a little confused. Uh, it could be the fact that since Fox throws out of rotation, uh, Westwood was supposed to get a point, but it doesn't always go that way. It looks like they're discussing the lineup. They're kind of pointing their fingers towards the court. All right, both of the refs are now leaving to go over to the scoreboard and talk to the teams, I believe, or talk to the scoreboard. Mr. Kayser. All right, I believe they are checking the rotation. Little confused. Yep. Both teams also look a tad bit confused. Mallory was ready to serve. Not sure if they'll give the serve to the other team. We'll see what's happening. All right, there you can see Sydney LeBeau and Alyssa doing a little dance. Everyone looks pretty happy. No one not really know what's knows what's going on. Not sure what they're talking about. Looks like everyone over in this whole place is a little confused. <laughs> All right, the refs are going to talk to Foxborough, and I believe it's because they were out of rotation. Westwood gets the point, but I'm not sure yet. Yeah, let's not get ahead of ourselves, Sarah. Yep, the coaches look a little concerned, a little disappointed. All right, I think they just gave them a warning. Yep, and Mallory will be serving. Yep, Coach Vicky's apologizing, so I think that was a warning. Probably because it's their senior night. Oh, yep. there's my poster right there. Yep, very nice. Lots of tape. <laughs> nice serve by Mallory Mayer. Goes very... And a out. hit that goes out. Foxborough nice. gets the point. 9-3. Let's see if Mallory can do it again. Yep. It's now 9-3. to three. Mallory goes in for her second serve. Very nice serve. Bear is able to get it up. Nice set. And hit that goes Ooh, very in. deep corner. That's a hard spot to get, but a good place to put a hit. All right, we're replaying that previous play. You can see she gets it up very nicely. Nice set and hit, but it goes out. All right, serve by number Gabby Collins. Able, able to, to get, get back. Out. Oh, but, but Sydney and Alyssa cannot return it over the net. They just need to communicate a little more. Vicky looks to now be getting a little angry. Yep. All right. That's over and out. That was out. Yes. Foxborough gets the point. And they're pretty happy. It looks like Sydney LeBeau will be serving. Sydney has a nice serve if she can get it over. Nice serve by Sydney. Oh, yep. and it's an ace. Yep, number 10, ten was able to get that up. See if Sydney can do it again. Yep, Sydney is a multi sport athlete and she also plays tennis. As do we. Yep. Here we go, Sydney. All right, nice serve by Sydney. They're able to get it up and hit. Another middle hit, deep back corner, same yep. spot. Foxborough really needs. All right, as you can see, Wes, uh, Sydney LeBeau is serving. They're able to get that. Oh, no, they're not. Number Fox 13, no served. All right, nice up. Ooh, nice over by Juliana. Smart thinking by Juliana Pettigrew. 
Nice dig by Sydney. Nice tip by middle, number three, Ava Kirk. Beautiful She's had hit. some pretty good tips and hits tonight. Yep. Ava three's Ava Kirk is only a junior. Next year she'll, she's going to be a senior, and let's hope she, she can keep it up next year. Nice All right, here's Julia Picker, who's had a nice game tonight. Looks Strong like her serve is in. Westwood's able to hit that over. Hit by Sadie Calabrese. Middle. Another hit. Cindy's able to get that up. Alyssa and hit by Sadie Calabrese. Ooh. Unfortunately, it goes just out, and Westwood gets the point on that. It's now 12 to 6. Up by Cindy. Set to middle, and Ava Kirk has a nice tip to the side behind the blockers. Yep. No oh, serving. Nice serve by number 9. Sydney. All right. Ooh, big hit by outside. Ooh. Unfortunately, unfortunately, Juliana just tries to set that up. It goes behind her head. That's all right. It happens to the best of us. Especially when you're not a setter, sometimes it can be difficult to set that up. Still serving number nine. Another strong serve. All right. Ooh, unfortunately. Nice. She hits that out. So it looks like Mallory got it over, but Westwood was able to return it, and Juliana set it backwards. For mm. the serve, number six. Shannon well. McElhaney, our libero. Yep. Let's go to Shannon. Nice serve. You can hear the crowd in the stands. Oh. Tip by. Looks like there was a lack of communication there. Yep. Westwood is cheering once again. There's still 15 through 7. As is that one dude that's always screaming in her section. Yep. Very nice supporter. Yep. All right. Nice serve. Juliana. Mallory. Nice deep corner, but Westwood was able to get it. Ooh, and hit into, into the, the net. net by number 15, and Foxborough gets the point. Looks like we've got some new fans in the building. And now Alyssa Clorty is serving. Let's hope she can get this serve over. As you remember from the in, beginning of the game, she in. got five or six in a row. Oh. Unfortunately, this one goes out. She just has too much power behind that serve. Serve by number eight. Very nice out. serve. Goes out, and nice. Foxrow gets that point. Shannon right. running. Shannon is giving this ball to Sadie, who has a nice serve, as long as she can keep it in. Let's see how she can do. Hopefully, Sadie can bring them back from this little slump they're in. Let's see what she can do. Nice, nice serve. serve. And I think City is a very unique serve. She throws up with only one hand. Yep. She's able to get that ball up and hit by Mallory. Ooh, but well Westwood's able to get it out. They have very good defense. Another deep corner. Westwood's just very consistent with those deep corners. I think Foxborough really needs to cover that spot. Yep. Maybe have their defense pull back a little for those hits. Now in once again, our senior, Gabby Collarin. Yep. Serving is number 22. Up by Mallory. Nice outside Beautiful hit by Lissa. Set. Oh, the Westwood blocks it. And it's now. All right, here's a replay on that last. Alyssa Corey has an amazing set and nice hit by Mallory, but Westwood's able to get that up beautifully. Westwood's playing very scrappy tonight. Right. Another outside attempt. Juliana gets over. Yep. Middle. Hit. Ooh, Foxborough once just again. Not able to return that. Timeout by Coach Vicky. Yep. I think she's going to talk about how Foxborough needs to be a little more consistent 
with their blocking and covering the back row because it seems like they're losing most of the points to the, oh, on the <laughs> cam are Sarah, Sarah Foley. Foley and Isabel Pacella and Noelle Buckley, all players <laughs> on the volleyball teams. As they're, well looking as they're looking Melvin. very happy. <laughs> Sarah Foley is the libero for the JV team and she always does a great job. Yep. All right, Coach Vicky's still just discussing a little bit with them. And they're all ready there <laughs> to be <laughs> Caitlin, and we're getting ready for the game to go back. All right, it looks like Foxborough is ready to get these points back. There's our fan section, pretty big tonight, lots of people in the crowd. All right, it looks like <laughs> Westwood still has the serve by number 22, who has a, quite a consistent serve. She's a nice server. I think she, they called the timeout on her last time, yep. too. I She's agree. able to get lots of points on the board for Westwood. Yep. Nice and serve. serve is very in. Off the block, Beautiful and hit nice by kill. Juliana Pettigrew. Now up to serve, Mallory, Mallory Meyer. Meyer. All right, let's see what she can do. Nice Ooh, serve, right over. right over the net, and Westwood's able to get that over with a hit oh. again into the deep corner, which is not being covered by Foxborough. They just need to communicate. Yep. Hit by 22, serve by 22. Shane's able to get it up. Now Alyssa sets it to outside, goes off the block. Very nice hit by Juliana Pettigrew. And I think Westwood is has realized by now that Foxborough tends to forget to cover the back corner, and that's where most of their hits are going. Free ball Over. by Juliana. Middle hit again. Beautiful oh. block, but unfortunately it goes on Foxborough's side, and Westwood wins yet another point. Currently, it is 21 to 10. Foxborough is losing. Let's hopefully they can get this back. Mm -hmm. All right, beautiful Ooh. serve. Oh, nice attempt. Foxborough hits it into the net. Gabby was able to get that up, but couldn't just not get it up quite high, high enough. So you can see it went over, and here's I the it middle. Off the block on Fox Rose's side. All right, you didn't Ooh. see it, but looks like it was an ace. an ace. Number 15, who's a strong hitter, is serving again. Fox Rose has got to communicate more. 15 is serving. Another miscommunication. This is very disappointing on senior night. Yep, I agree. It's an awful feeling when you just look at the other person, you know, oh, I screwed up. Yep. Got to communicate. It's the most important part of volleyball. Yep. Nice, nice up, up by, by Cindy. Cindy LeBeau. Outside and hit. Let's see if she can do it again. Westwood's able to hit that Another over. Another hit across. Foster. Another Beautiful tip by Ava by Kirk. Ava Kirk, she's having an amazing night. And Ava is an amazing player, and she'll be even better next year. All right, now up to serve sort of Sydney Lebo. Let's hope she can rack up a few points. Nice serve by Sydney. Goes over the net. Outside hit. Oh, nice, nice shot by Mallory. Mallory. Nice hit by, by Ava. Ava Kirk. Yet again, always getting those points for Foxborough. She's pretty tall, which makes her really good. All right, here's an instant replay. She this sets it over. To get it up. This one's able to get it up. Little nice hit. hit. Alyssa's able to get that up. And Ava is able to get a nice hit over there. Oh, uh, just All missed right. the point that happened, but Foxborough got it. And Sydney LeBeau, number five, is serving. 
Let's hope maybe she can bring them back. Yep. Unfortunately, Sydney serves into the net. There is a lot of pressure on the game winning, not the game winning, but the set, set winning. winning point. Unfortunately, she just wasn't right. able to get that up. So, second set score is 25 13 Westwood. Unfortunately, Foxborough seemed to have yep. gained less points. Hopefully, in the third set, they can bring it back. Right? Yep. Westwood seems to be very happy. And we're just taking a break right now between sets. Players are getting their water, regrouping. Let's hope Foxborough can pull this back. Maybe Coach Vicky will switch up the lineup a little bit, get some other people in there. Yep, I agree. I think Westwood will probably keep the same lineup. They've been doing pretty well. It doesn't, it doesn't look like mm -hmm. something they would do. Looks like there's a little bit of a longer break this time. Yep. Still got around two minutes left. Just want to point out Ava Kirk's amazing game tonight. She's really had quite a few nice plays, and I can't wait to see how well she does mm -hmm. next year. Same thing with Mallory Meyer. She's also a junior, and she's done very good in the back row, digging those balls and throwing herself on the ground basically anytime she can. Yep, and both seniors, Gabby and Sadie, have had some amazing plays tonight mm -hmm. on their senior night, and they've also both had some amazing serves. Serves. There's our people in the studio. Yep, say Thanks hi. to them for putting this program together for all of you people to watch at home. Yep. Sometimes you just can't be there to see it yourself. Oh, and here's There's some of our, our student fans. sections. Holding up some posters yep. to support our seniors and varsity team. Yep. Um, student section has a lot of people in it tonight. Mm -hmm. Looks like Westwood is now back on the court. They don't seem to be having a lot of, using a lot of their time to go over plays or anything. They must think they got it wrapped under the belt. But <laughs> I know Foxboro can be sly and pull through. Yep, I agree. So, they shouldn't let their guard down, Westwood. Yep. There's our student section. Mostly Quite adults. Not that full. And then you can see all of our posters on the walls yep, that we made for, for our, our seniors, seniors tonight. Uh, Sadie Calabrese's color was pink, and Gabby Collins' color was black and gold. Rawr. Yep. All right, we're just doing a lineup check, actually. And All right. Fox wasn't on the court yet. We're pretty hyped for this game. You can see everyone's pretty interested. You can hear the chanting coming from our Foxborough student section. Yep, and you can see that little girl who's been quite excited in this game, this mm -hmm. little boy also. There goes Caitlin Sergi leaving the game. Fake. All right, Foxborough is getting into it. I think they can still pull back a lead on Westwood. Looks like we have the same starting six as before. There's our and cameraman. There's our cameraman. We'll take it one play at a time. All right, let's hope Foxborough can keep it up. There's our other cameraman. We'll be able to have this program without them filming, so let's I thank them. I believe that is Sarah Foley's dad, uh, Libero on the JV team. Mm -hmm. All right, Fox Barrel Alyssa Cordy has the serve. She seems to have a quite uh, consistent serve. She's also a pl tennis player with us. Let's see what she can do. Beautiful nice serve. serve by Alyssa Clority. They were able to get that up, and nice hit, but Into they're not the able net. to get it over. And Fox Barrel gets that point. Let's hope they can keep it up. There's Alyssa Clority with another serve. Another beautiful serve. Libero's able to get it up. And back row hit. Nice beautiful back row, back row hit. Chains able to save it and over by Alyssa Clority. Middle tip. This is able to get it up. Back row hit. Nice, nice back hit. row hit. Nice by job, Shannon. Shannon McKinley.
All right, Foxborough has the serve. Foxborough has the serve yet again. Mm-hmm, they do. All right, let's see Hopefully if Alyssa can pull it, it off. Again. Yep, oh, unfortunately oh. her serve goes just out and Westwood gets that point. A little too much power in yep. sauce. Well, Alyssa still has a very nice serve. We're just replaying that. Shannon's able to back that up, and Alyssa's able to get it over the net. Yep, a key part in volleyball is being able to back up your teammates, and you can see Alyssa do that there. All right, nice up by Alyssa. Nice and back row. Hit, hit by, by Shannon. Shannon. What just happened was number eight on Westwood serve, and Sydney and Juliana miscommunicated, both went for the ball, and they shanked it. Number eight is serving. Okay. Tied up, two to two. Beautiful serve by number eight. Nice set. Oh. And unfortunately, Mallory hits it into the net. Mallory has a strong hit as long as she can get it over. And time it right. Timing is very important. Yep. Here goes number eight, and again. Into the net. She hits it into the net, and Foxborough wins that point. Tied up yet again, three to three. Now coming in, Eva Kirk once again. Let's hope she can get some tips and hits in there for Foxborough. Yep. Here goes Mallory Mayer. Up by number eight on Westwood. Outside hit. Another beautiful hit by number 17. Oh, good try on Foxborough's side to get that over. But unfortunately, they were not able to get the ball over. I think number 17 is definitely one of Westwood's best players. She has very consistent serves and hits right over. All right, there goes the libero, number one, who has a jump serve. Let's see if she can get this one over. Nice yep, serve. Very nice serve. Jordan Hargrew. Free by Sydney. Right side. Ooh, into the and net. Into the net by number 11. Foxborough gets a point. Hit up by Mallory Mayer. Julian is able to help out. Unfortunately, Alyssa is not able to get that in and over. Almost dead. And here's a senior Sydney captain Arson. once again. Nice. Consistent serve. And 17. Ooh. Yeah, another beautiful hit. Her hits really are impressive. Back right side hit. Oh, unfortunately. Same thing with number 11. She also has goes a, off the block. a nice hit. Um, last time she hit, she hit it into the net, but this time she was able to correct herself. And now number 11 is serving. Let's see what she can do. Nice, nice up, and Mallory and Alyssa, and, and Ava, Ava gets the point for Foxborough. Yet Very again. nice tip. I think Ava's definitely their star player tonight for Foxborough. And now in sophomore Gianna Dunn up to serve once again. Gianna Dunn started her freshman year and is now on varsity. She has a pretty nice serve. So let's see it. Oh, pretty good serve. Pretty deep. Yep. Outside hit. Tip. Nice job. Juliana's up. able to help it. Over by Juliana. Middle. Ooh. Hit that goes in. Is that Just nice? Foxborough gets the point. All right. You can see Mallory get that up. Alyssa help it out. Ava Kirk tip it right over. Another beautiful hit by Ava Kirk tonight. Into the net by the libero. Foxborough now has the lead. Yep, seven to five. five. Hopefully Gianna can serve another good one. Yep. Another good serve. Unfortunately, Ooh. goes out by Gianna. Gianna tends to have a floating serve. Floating serves tend to go out. Too much power. Now up to serve. Number 17 for Westwood. Strong server and hitter. Nice serve. Ooh. Oh. Ooh, nice up and They're able to save Shannon's it. Shannon's able to put it over. Beautiful nice hit block. by number eight. Nice block. Oh. 
Westwood, they go up for the joust and Westwood wins it. All right, another serve by number 17. Out. Yep, Foxborough gets the point. Off right, the block. Nice and then a joust, but Westwood wins it. Yep. All right, serving now is Juliana Pettigrew, who's had a nice game tonight. Set, set, and Push. set. Oh. Fox Pro is just not able to get that point. They're still in this game, though. Eight to eight, tied up. Now up to serve once again is 22, which seems to be Westwood's star server of the night. Let's see if she gets some nice serves again. Nice over by Alyssa. Point goes to Foxborough Fox for Fox two touches on Westwood. Very nice. Let's see if Foxborough can get this game back. That's He's outside. And another push. Foxborough's just not able to get that. Gianna Dunn does die for it. All right, now serving is number six, Shannon M. McElhaney. She's a very hard name to pronounce. Yep. Beautiful serve by Shannon, nice and it's serve. an ace. It is an ace. Ball comes over to us. All right, Shannon McElhaney serving again. <laughs> Is that her friend? Oh, and it looks like Gab Gabby Karin's dad retrieves the ball. Hawksborough has the lead right now. Hopefully they can keep it up. Beautiful serve by Shannon McElhaney. And hit that, that goes, goes out. out. Nice Foxborough job, Foxborough. Another point. Foxborough's in the game. Still in this? Serve by. And the set that goes back. She out and she gets an ace. You can hear the Westwood fans cheering. Let's hopefully they don't ice. Shannon McElhaney, here she goes. Nice oh. serve, but unfortunately it goes just out. And Westwood gets that point. More serves that have too much power behind them. Yep. Tends to be a common theme for Foxborough. Hopefully they can improve on that. Now Ooh. serving number 12. I don't think she's. Have you seen her serve yet? Uh, we have. Over by Gianna Dunn. And hit. Number eight tends to have a lot of hits. Up. And another hit by Ooh. number eight. Foxborough shanks it. Big kill for Westwood outside. Gets that point. Eight on Westwood. <clears throat> Still serving, number 12 on Westwood. Yep. Gianna has a nice up. Big hit by Mallory on outside. And Westwood is not able to receive that. And here's a replay up by Sadie over. Westwood's up, Libero puts it over, and number eight gets a hit that Foxborough unfortunately shanks. Mm -hmm. Now serving Alyssa once again. Nice Beautiful serve. Beautiful serve by Alyssa. Looks like it's gonna be a hit. Wow, I'm surprised she was able to hit that over though. Yep. Really to the side. Serving once again Alyssa. Hopefully she can rack up some points for Foxborough. Yep. Ooh, hard serve. Ooh, Ooh nice, very nice up and libero. And oh. unfortunately, Westwood is not able to get that over. Foxborough stays in the lead, 14 to 10. Once again, that miscommunication. Two people go for the ball, and it never ends well. Mm -hmm. You can see the Westwood coach is starting to get a little nervous. Which she should be. Beautiful serve by Alyssa Clorty, goes right over the net. And another hit by the libero that isn't able to get over. 
Foxborough gets the point. And look again. at that. The Westwood coach has called a timeout. Yep. Here's a nice replay for you. Look at that oh. beautiful dive. And then Libero is able to get it. Unfortunately, the two Westwood players bang Don't into communicate. each other. And it's not able to go over. It's always great when the other team's the one who calls the timeout. Foxborough is starting to get some of their energy and excitement back. Hopefully they keep it through the rest of the set. I agree. There's our fan section. Let's go. Mm-hmm. Starting up a chant, Sarah Foley, our number one morale booster. All right, you can see the Warriors. Right, Fox and Westwood back on the court. Yeah. Hopefully they don't ice Alyssa and she's able to get another good serve over. Side hit. Nice Ooh, up nice save for Juliana. Now he's able to give it back over. Middle push. Up by Juliana. Sadie Calabrese gets it over. Outside and hit. Another hit by number eight. Ooh, they able to return it. It's a good rally. Outside hit push. Push. Nice job nice by, Sadie. by Sadie. Hit. Shannon's able to get it up. Oh, Alyssa overshot that just a little bit, bumped it a little too far. Here's a previous play. Alyssa Cordy gets it right over the net, and number one shakes it into the ground. Nice play by Alyssa Cordy. Now serving number eight for Westwood. Nice up by Juliana. Outside set. Nice hit by Cindy LeBeau. Right side, push. Middle. Oh, falls Fox too Rose short. Just not able to get that ball over. Right now, Foxborough does have the lead. Hopefully, they can keep it. 16 to 12. Now, serving again is number eight, who has a, quite a consistent serve. Goes right over. But it is and out. Foxborough gets the point. There's a replay, nice push up by Alice Clority. Cindy LeBeau sets it, and Sadie's not able to put it over. Now Here's serving a serve nine. by Mar Mayer. Up by 17, and hit by number 11. Beautiful up by Alyssa Clority. And Shannon has a nice back row hit. Push, Shannon's able to get that. Middle hit by Sadie Calabrese, senior captain. Shannon with the very good defense once again. And nice hit by Shannon. Yep. Beautiful Ooh. hit by number eight. Foxborough stays in the lead, 17 to 13. Hopefully they can keep that going. Mm -hmm. Number See? one, the libero is serving again. She has a nice jump serve. With hits like those, you like can't be mad because they're just so good. Yep. All right, Foxborough says a four point lead. Oh, almost. I think that was a smart tactic. She's been serving pretty deep the whole game, so she decided to go short this time and threw them off. Now there's a replay. Nice replay. Back row and hit, hit, and it was very good. Beautiful hit, and they're not able to receive that. Now nice 22 tip with the tip. 22. And again, serving number one, the libero. Foxborough's got to keep it up. Can't let Westwood catch up. If they lose this set, they lose the game. Ooh, nice. big up. Timeout by Foxborough. So timeout was called and she served anyway. Coach Vicky just wants to make sure that they're able to keep this lead. Mm -hmm. And Westwood, is. I think they're feeling pretty confident that they're going to pull back. Pull up. Yep, but let's hope Foxborough can keep it up. 
Some people look pretty nervous on the team. There's a replay of the Bear number one serving for Westwood. Nice up by Mallory. That's Alyssa. Now in volleyball, even if it does hit the rafters, you can still play the point. Yep, but if it hits it and goes over, then it is the team. And there is our ball. Wouldn't be able to do the game without you. <laughs> so funny. All right, so we're gonna get is there libero number, number one. one, who has a beautiful jump serve. Once again with the short serve, good tactic. Outside hit. Tip, tip. Oh. Yes. Unfortunately, Sydney is not able to block that well enough. Now 17 to 16, Foxborough. Serving again is number one for Westwood. All right, let's see if she can get this over. Now with the deep Beautiful serve. Beautiful serve. Nice hit by Juliana Pettigrew. Right side Set hit. And, ooh, ooh Shan's able to get it up. Nice hit again by Juliana, deeper. And unfortunately, oh. Juliana hits the net, it looks like, and Westwood gets that point. It's now tied up 17 to 17. Hopefully, Foxborough can pull back. Pull up. All right, another, another serve by number one on Westwood. Nice able to get it up, middle. Nice tip Beautiful. by Sadie Calabrese. And Foxborough is in the lead once again. With some people in the crowd that are really cheering on for Sadie. Yep. Sadie now up for the serve. Hopefully she can keep it in the court. Fortunately, her serve goes out. out. And they are tied up once again, 18 to 18. Close game, folks. Now serving number 15, who has had some strong hits tonight. All right, let's see what she can do. She's a nice server. Jump serve, beautiful serve, up by Mallory, set by Alyssa. Oh. And Westwood gets the point, 19 to 18 Westwood. Again to serve number 15. Who has a beautiful jump serve. Amazing up by Shannon McElhaney. Oh, and that was deep corner. Beautiful hit by Juliana Pettigrew. Beats them at their own game. Let's look at this nice right. hit. Juliana. Goes up for it, swings, oh. and hits it to the net. All right. All right, serving now is Gianna Dunn. Last time her serve went out. Hopefully she's able to keep this one in. Nice float serve. That in. And it goes oh. straight over. That was a beautiful play by Westwood. Now serving number 17 on Westwood. She has a beautiful hit, a beautiful serve. Let's see if she can do it again. Goes oh. over. Yep. Ava Kirk. Nice hit once hit. again by Ava. I think yep. Ava's definitely our MVP of the night. Yep. Ava's doing a wonderful job. Here's Gianna serving. Westwood. Nice set over the net, and Fox Rose not expecting that. All now right. serving Juliana. Hit by, Juliana. Hit by the libero. Beautiful back row hit by libero. She's, she has some nice back row hits. Ava Kirk. Off Ava's block, unfortunately. Lands on Foxborough's side. Yep. Now 21 to 20, Westwood. Foxborough can still pull through. Now serving number nine. She has a nice serve. I don't, it's not a jump serve, but it is quite nice. Let's hope Foxborough can return this. 
Fox was able to get that up. Nice set. And hit nice by hit by Mallory. Mallory. And Westwood's not able to block that and tied up again, 21 to 21. Westwood has now called a timeout. Looks like their coach is starting to sweat a little bit. Which means get nervous. All right. Number nine serving for Westwood. And nice up by Shannon. Beautiful hit by Mallory. Yep. So it looks like Westwood's just reevaluating themselves. Okay. Foxborough is probably trying to keep up their energy through Make these sure last few not points. Be iced. Yep. Oh, in volleyball, iced means like when the other team calls a timeout while you're serving. Trying to get you to like break your momentum. Yep. And typically it works. Yeah. But let's hope this doesn't work. There's, There's our, our ball, ball. again. <laughs> now serving Shannon McElhaney, a libero. Tied up 21 to 21. Let's hope Foxwell can pull through. Beautiful serve by Shannon. Unfortunately, it goes Ooh. out and Westwood gets that point. Too much power once again. Now serving number 12 for Westwood. Come on, Foxborough. Set by Gianna. That's set hit by Mallory. Unfortunately, oh. Foxborough hits the net and Westwood gets that point. It's now 23 to 21. Remember, this is a win by two game. Vicky has now unfortunately called a timeout. Westwood's two points away from victory and Foxborough's loss. All right. There's a replay on that. Number 12 serving. Please serve. Set by Gianna. Unfortunately, Mallory goes up to hit and hits the net. to the fan section. Once again, Sarah Foley leading a cheer. Let's see if Westwood can keep this up or if Foxborough can pull back. Pull up. Right. I don't know why we keep saying pull back. Yeah, me either. Um, <laughs> serving again is number 12 from Westwood. Hopefully she was ice and we'll hit this one in the net or out. Yep. Looks like that's going in. Oh, that's an point. ace. It is now 24 to 21. Hopefully Foxborough can pull Game through on these last play. few points. Let's hope she does not get this over. Nice up, up by Gianna. Nice hit, hit by, by Mallory. Mallory. Outside hit, oh. Mallory's able to help it. Nice hit, hit by, by Sadie. Sadie. Up by 12. Right Set side and hit. Right side hit. Out. It goes out. Yo, and let's gets go. The point. That's nice. It is now 24 to 22. There's a replay on that. Let's play. see. All right. Serve by number 12. And it's Gianna Dunn's foot and goes out. Okay. Otherwise, it probably would have been out. Now serving Alyssa Cloverty, yep. I believe. She's got a strong serve. Let's just hope she doesn't hit it out. All right, the ref's just going back to his position. And let's hope Alyssa, Alyssa tones it down a little bit, keeps it in the court. Yep, and pulls through for Fox Girl for the set. Foxborough looks ready. Very nerve wracking. Game winning point. Nice. Oh, serve. Nice oh. Unfortunately, Foxborough has lost the game tonight. They played a very nice night. game, as well as Westwood. It 
just give a shout out to Foxborough seniors, Gabby Colleran and Sadie Calabrese. Both played beautifully as well as Ava Kirk and Mallory Meyer. Yep. They're now saying their goodbyes. And here's a replay and on that last play. Point. Up by the libero. And, and a hit. beautiful hit by number 15. It was unable to be returned by Foxborough. I think overall they had a pretty good senior night, pretty good Both game. Teams played a beautiful game. And as you can see, that is Foxborough. Fortunately, they weren't able to pull through that for the, with that win, but Westwood. they should be proud of themselves, especially yep. the seniors have had a pretty good season. Yep. All right. All right. There's some of our students. Everyone's getting up. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, that was only a three-set game. Good. Thank you for watching. That was a great game played by both teams.